Calling all card makers. Personal Shopper May kit is available now. So let's open up, get our pink tissue out of the way. And here are our 10 cards and envelopes. So we'll set those aside. Our newsletter is going to show us every single card and give us all of the instructions that we need just to make them perfectly or to change them as you see fit. Now here's the gift card in a color this time. You're going to get a sheet of um, gold uh, jewel dazzles and there are uh, over a hundred on this one sheet and very fun to use. Now we've got a sheet of die cuts also and so you'll see how that's going to be used. And look at this beautiful laser lace. We just found this and so we wanted to save it for card makers first of all. Now our embellishment uh, pack is a collection of very different things and it's always kind of fun to see this and then more importantly to see how they're used. I wonder what's going to happen with this uh, popsicle stick. Hmm, we've got some ribbons, some that are printed on, A Star is Born, as well as some little pom-poms. We've got some brads, a uh, metal button, a sheer flower, and also some of the sparkly fiber. So that looks fun. Let's see. Oh my gosh, I was wondering why it was a 12 by 12 box. Well, it's because the Superstar template is enclosed and members tell us they absolutely love getting a template because it's reusable. And this particular one has a lot of ideas on it as well as tons and tons of different kinds of stars. Now our papers this month are like always, there are 16 sheets and there's always the art as well as blank art so that you can always change the message to be exactly what you want. So we'll set this aside and look and see what our cards are this month. Our first card is going to take advantage, as many of the cards are, of that star template. And I love this look of a patriotic star. I Heart USA is part of the art. And the inside is a uh, party like an American. Happy 4th of July. This can also be changed into just a very fun birthday card or congratulations or even a graduation card. Here is a very western looking card and our sheriff badge up here. We've got, this is where that metal button gets used. Isn't that fun? And inside we're wrangling up the presents and the cake. Now, we have a very fun and people love it when we do these kind of uh, humorous cards. This is the pom-pom ribbon and we have a conga line that's made out of conga line rats. <laughs> yeah, so that's a conga rat. And then inside, oh, it's a congratulations card. And again, you can always change that message. Now here's a very different take on a Christmas card. It's a Christmas gift for you. And we've got some stacked uh, stars and those jewel dazzles are just shining all over here. There you go. You can really see it and along the bottom too. So we've got a very fun row of gifts along the bottom, but it's just really fun, I think, to see a very different color combination. And as always, the inside of the card is completed for you. Now here is a uh, princess card. This is a birthday card for a girl and it's also using um, the gold jewel dazzles and we have a little um, magic wand that's also used with that star template and then inside another one and a beautiful little message along with these papers. Now the uh, laser lace paper has uh, three of these uh, scoops on it so two of them are used on the front of this card and this is the die cut tag that has been covered up with paper got a little bit of lace at the top there also and there's that third scoop that's used on the inside of the card we have a kind of a 3d card with this very fun pinwheel and as you get in this is one of the uh, buttons that was used in or into the embellishment and that's going in the center the papers you can see we're using more of the jewel dazzles Ah, that's where that popsicle stick went, right onto this very fun card. I love the sunshine coming from the side. And then this is what we call a just a note card. So there it is. So you can write your message. You can write a brief note thinking of you, sending encouragement or best wishes. Now our little card is uh, the gift card, and this is a bonus card each month. Look at that tiny little tag at the top. I think that's a great look. 
Now many of our cards are going to have envelopes. The first one that I see is this old guy's rock card, which is, I think, so interesting and very fun to do. I love the papers. They're so different. And uh, although he has a star, he does have a rocking chair. And these are some of the die cuts of this month. And then inside, you are never too old to rock like a star. That's a great birthday message. Now, the companion envelope looks like this, and it has a great look on the flap with another one of those stars. Speaking of stars, we would be remiss if we didn't give a shaped card in the star. And this is a welcome baby. A star is born. It's a 100% cute welcome baby. And then inside, this is how it's done. So very clever that when this card was designed, we're going to see that the uh, card is laid out flat, the art is put down, the inside is covered, it's closed, and this is cut out. But in order to get this shape, which you know would be pretty tricky, we've cut it out of the back of the card. And then when the inside was covered, that covered up that evacuated space. So that's a great look. We are also here using the outside area of those jewel dazzles. So it makes a very striking little border. So nothing goes to waste when you're using uh, dazzles. And here's the envelope that was designed to coordinate with this card. Very, very pretty. Our 10th card, and don't you love the fact that every single card is different and every single card has different color combinations? You know, that's not always true with every club. Isn't that swirl just beautiful? And that has been inked. And this is going to be a different card. Let me get it open for you. That when I open it, look what happens. We'll back up. Let me do that again. So here's the front of the card. And then when I open it, it has this great interactive area. And I just, I love the colors and the uh, images on this. So this is a happy birthday. May the best of your past be the worst of your future. What a great message. And then we do have a coordinating envelope for this one. So that's it for May 2011.